Microsoft will launch its latest and greatest operating system, Windows 10, on the 29th of July. And here are the 10 most important things you need to know about the new software. Windows 10 is free. Well, it's free for anyone with a valid Windows 7 and Windows 8 license for the first 12 months after its release. After that, and for a new license, you'll have to pay £99. Not everyone will be able to upgrade to Windows 10 on launch day. Microsoft is planning a phased rollout of Windows 10, and those currently testing early versions of the software will be first in line to get the update on the 29th of July. Windows 10 will work on pretty much any computing device you can think of. From traditional desktops, laptops, tablets and smartphones, to Microsoft's Xbox games console, and even Internet of Things devices and servers, Microsoft's Windows 10 has it covered. Windows 10 will be able to talk to you and you will be able to talk to it. Cortana is Microsoft's answer to Siri and it has been deeply integrated into Windows 10, meaning you will be able to ask your PC whatever you like. Windows 10 means the end of Internet Explorer. While it is still in there somewhere, Microsoft has replaced the venerable browser with Microsoft Edge, an all-new browser which the company says is going to be blastingly fast. Windows 10 will even be holographic. As we said, Windows 10 will be everywhere, and that includes Microsoft's new HoloLens augmented reality headset, meaning developers' apps can easily be tweaked to work in three dimensions. There's not one, but seven versions of Windows 10 being launched. Windows 10 Home will be the main consumer version most of us will be using, while Windows 10 Pro will be focused on small businesses, and Windows 10 Enterprise aimed at bigger businesses. Windows 10 Mobile is its smartphone play, with Windows 10 Mobile Enterprise the same for business. Windows 10 Education is, unsurprisingly, aimed at schools and universities, while Windows 10 IoT Core is aimed at connected devices. Windows 10 is going to be a big deal for gamers. From the latest graphics support with DirectX 12 to cross-platform multiplayer with Xbox games and the ability to stream games from an Xbox One to a PC, Windows 10 promises to be a big upgrade for gamers. Windows 10 will allow developers to create one app that will work across all platforms. To help drive interest in creating apps for the Windows Store, Microsoft is promising developers they only need to write their app once and it will work on everything from desktops to smartphones. And finally, the Smart Menu is back with Windows 10. One of the biggest gripes people had with Windows 8 was the removal of the Start Menu in desktop mode, but Microsoft has clearly been listening to feedback as it's back in Windows 10. And it looks great with the inclusion of live tiles alongside the traditional menu. 